<laughs> what is going on, everybody? Depraved Slash here. We are back with another music reaction on Depraved. I'm Hellcat. Together we are Hella Depraved. Take it away! E. Another icon for higher song off of Amorphous. We only have one more left. I'm... Yes. It's it's getting to After that this. bittersweet point. It really is. I've loved this entire album, so I'm super excited to be able Enemies to... Enemies is still my favorite song. Yeah. Actually, I, I think I'd probably have to agree with you on that one. Um, Brittle is, is close up there for me. But, so, we are on to the next one. And then... What, after tomorrow I'll be able to play it all in one fell swoop, however many times I want? You'll be able to play with it all you want, baby. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, we are super excited for this. Yeah. So, with that being said, we're going to react to this if you guys already heard it. If not, click the link in the description below, hop on over, listen to it, like it, sub to it, do all the things. Support them. They're independent artists. It's completely crowdfunded. And then come on back. And we say that because we're a reaction commentary breakdown channel, there will probably be pauses. Oh, there will definitely be pauses. Yes. Yeah. So, with that being said, it is time to slash it up and break it down. This is Icon for Hire with... Warrior. Warrior. <laughs> so, different song. It's also called Warrior, <laughs> but... There's so very few. That would be hip-hop and Lloyd Banks. Genre of music artist. I didn't want them to think hip hop was an actual artist. Right. That would be Somebody somewhere has got to have that name. Really? Really? Somewhere. Oh. That's tragic. It would be. Yeah, really. Okay. Let's get it. Let's watch this. Yeah. Listen to this? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna watch it too. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> This beat hurt, but it's not over. I lost my voice and my composure. Cut wide open, I need closure. Tried to get to it quicker. First of all, it sounds amazing. Second of all, she's got some sneaky little doubles in there. I love her voice too. Very nice. I like it how how it's written lyrically, but I also appreciate like so uh, this beat heart instead of heartbeat because she was talking about being black and blue. Uh, and then she said cut wide open and I need closure because you know that's what. Stitches closing a wound, but also, so I I like that she plays with stuff like that, even in a more serious format. I will always appreciate wordplay in yeah. rock songs because I don't feel rock artists do it enough. Right, I agree, and I think Ariella is actually one of the better ones at doing it. Well, she also thinks frequently. Honestly, I feel like she also thinks more with a hip hop state of mind in her writing. Yes, and yes, she does. She does. I mean, I feel like she does a good job at thinking from both sides of the coin. Right. So, yeah. But I, that's why I'm smiling, not just because she sounds gorgeous, but, you know, it's like, oh, that's, that's... Tricky, tricky! Yeah. Sneaky, sneaky. It's tricky! <laughs> to rock around. Uh, plus, I like the heartbeat sound when the, the beat hit. So... Strong it makes me And I gotta say I told you she thinks with a hip hop state of mind. <laughs> For those of you that don't know, that is That's great. actually a play on a song called Damn It Feels Good to Be a Gangster. 
That is fantastic. She gets a round of applause for that. Plus, she did it in sort of like the uh, valley girl kind of, you know, bratty right. sort of tone of voice. Like, ha ha, <laughs> I came out on top. Ha! Yeah, it's great. <laughs> Pretty much. Blind blue worms? Something lungs. Oh, I don't know. That's why I was rewinding it. Something, I'm like, yeah, I've no. understood everything perfectly. Everything opposite. Until here. But I did catch this deep breath now. To my, to my lungs? Something. It's to something my lungs. We'll see. Deep breath now. Two brand new lungs. Ah, all right. I caught the two in the lungs. All right. Okay. Oh, Sorry, it's going to drive me crazy, so I looked it up. Yeah, well, I'm glad I saw him pick up the phone and I knew what you were doing. I was like, I was about to. run on solar energy okay. you go girl <laughs> well to be fair to be fair humans kind of do yeah they do they do being out in the sun and it has been scientifically proven that it actually helps boost your energy levels well and lift depression not Me? completely obviously but on the other hand hack into your your uh chemistry is what she was talking about you know i do better dancing with the devil by the pale moonlight I do better with the moonlight too, but honestly, I I don't burn either, so I'm not sure what that says about which part of me is you know from where. No clue. Yeah, but nice little rap verse though. It, it definitely was. I also uh, liked the uh, changing of the cortex. prefrontal cortex. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like, ooh, we're getting anatomy lessons in here. This is great. That's no. Not that kind of anatomy. Get your mind out together. Well. The rooftop now I want on solar energy.
That's a weird way to end it. That is okay. a weird way to end it. I mean, I I liked the the entire thing until that end. You're just vibing, and it's like, oh. Yeah, I don't like the end. I I will admit that right there, like the a, last two seconds. I I need like a calm build, down. Calm down. Yeah. Moment. Yeah. yeah. You ran me fast and or hard. You gotta end, I need a couple cool off. Laps. Or you got to end on like a strong note, <laughs> which is True. also fine. Yeah, yeah, but but to end mid trail. Yep. I hate cliffhangers too. Yeah. So there is that, but that yeah, I really liked it though. Icon for Hire is slowly turning into one of my favorite bands you've introduced me to. They're definitely close to the top in terms of, and I'm so reticent to say stuff like that because I'm so eclectic that it's hard for me when people are like, oh, who are your favorite artists? I'm like, from what genre? <laughs> what subgenre? How what long do you have about? to listen? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but Icon for Hire honestly has been since I found them like three, three, four years ago. So, I, I mean, before Hollow and everything. But, <clears throat> but... We have one more song on this we album, do. which means you have one more chance to knock Enemies off number one for me. It Ooh, has not happened yet. That's going to be yet. rough, because honestly, out of their entire discography, Enemies, Enemies is, is one of your my favorites. favorite. Uh, is yeah. your overall favorite? Okay. I mean, so, is the next one Venom? Do you remember seeing? I don't remember the name. Okay. I just knew this one was hmm. next. It was after Tools and uh, I'm okay. making shit up. Rocks but, and stem stones. And sticks, and <laughs> sticks and stones. Peaky blinders. Right. You know, <laughs> um, yeah, I Paper mean, cut. enemies, brittle, and I'm ignoring you now. Hollow. <laughs> those those have been some of my favorites, but enemies still, still top of the list. So I don't. Uh... Enemies was so good. It is still, right now, the only song off this album I actually remember the name to off of one listen. Right. Yeah, that's... I, I mean, again, it's one listen. That's the thing. And that was one of the first ones that we listened to when we the first... went through not including the singles. Yeah, Yeah, it was the first one we listened to once the album came out. Right. It's also the first song on the album, so I mean... But still, they started off strong. But yeah, the, it's been strong. The it's prefrontal just... cortex for anybody that doesn't know or didn't look it up is the area of your brain that is said to control your consciousness, your um, conscious choice, your you know ability to. Um, well, I mean, it also controls like guilt, shame, shit like that too. <clears throat> You gonna look it up? No, I'm reading the rap oh, verse. Oh, okay. <laughs> but it is often the place that is um, looked into for damage if people become violent or are serial killers for some sort of damage, whether a tumor or if they became violent after an accident, because you right. just no longer you really care in terms of like morals and ethics and <laughs> right yeah interesting though so i liked it i really liked it i did too still not necessarily top of my list in in terms of this album but no in fun. this album i'd say it's near the top for me yeah not for me but i'm also thinking of all the singles that we've covered in the last year almost just, that are off of this it's just still not quite enemies yeah it's not quite enemies but you know there was brittle there's the cur curse or cure almost any time she raps in a song it's gonna get right. moved up towards the top for me right and do not get me wrong she has an absolutely beautiful singing voice too but being the hip-hop fan that i am right that's true that's true that's uh, again i absolutely adore their um original style too you know hollow and everything that came before that um if venom is the next one which i know i've heard um, how have you heard it because it was released before cheater. i even came out here cheater it was like one of the first singles released off of this 
And I didn't realize it was leading up to an album. It was like a year ago. Hush. You were doing this with me a year ago. It was before I came out here. Anyway. Anyway. That one is a little bit more hip hoppy, but yeah. It was it was very good. Okay. Yes. With that being said, if you guys <laughs> like the video, slash that like button, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications, comment down below. What did you think of Icon for Hire with Warrior? <laughs> Warrior. Sorry. Also comment down below. If there's anything else you guys want to see reacted to, check the description below for all the things. We'll push our buttons. Come join us on our other social media platforms, mostly Twitter if you want a quicker response. With that being said, <laughs> I am Bratman. No. We love you guys. Thank you all for watching. For the error. <laughs> and we cannot wait to see you, brave people, later. Peace. <laughs>